Hi my Aries, it's uh, Jamie Zebra 23 I'm doing your mid-month December 2016 tarot card reading. I'm using the Rider Waite tarot deck. I pulled five cards, um, shuffled, laid them out, um, saged them, stoned them up. All right, so I am on Facebook. It's Jamie Zebra 23 if you'd like to like me. Um, I advertise reading specials and I do all sorts of fun stuff on Facebook. Um, also, I do uh, personal readings. It's um, it's uh, jamiezebra23 at gmail.com. The personal readings are $25 for 15 minutes, um, $50 for 30 minutes, $75 for 50 minutes, 50, and then I've um, started a new one. If you just have like a quick question that you need answered, you can email it to me. Um, it's $5. you got to prepay, of course, for any of the readings because I cannot give you a time slot unless you prepay. Um, that, that holds your spot. That schedules your reading. Also, because um, I've got... The same time that people are emailing me, I've got other people emailing me that have already purchased the reading. So, I, so uh, I get people that email me. They're like, "Oh, can uh, can you when can you do the reading?" I don't know because you didn't you know you didn't schedule it, which is the prepaying. So, but you've got a bunch of people that you know I can't tell you one o'clock, and then you you know I've got five other people that have already paid that want one o'clock. I can't give it to you. So, yeah, so let's jump right in. So you got the, uh, the King of Pentacles, you got the Page of Pentacles, you got the Page of Wands, you got the Knight of Cups, and then you got the Ten of Cups. So this is telling me, Aries, that some of you are dealing with a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. This Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo, um, I feel like they've ignored you, or they put you on the back burner, or you feel like they're not interested, or you haven't heard from them in a while. Um, the Page of Pentacles is saying that they will contact you. Um... But it looks like um, when they do contact you, you're interested in a water sign, Aries. This, uh, yeah, so now your, your focus is on a water sign. So this water sign is coming in. And this water sign could offer you a happy home. Either this person already owns their own home, they've got two children, and you're just going to be, like, added to the situation. Or um, this, is you, uh, this is you moving in. Oh, yeah, this is you moving in with them because look what's at the bottom of the, of the deck. This is the Knight of Wands. This is a uh, departure, absence, um, a change of residence. So some of you um, Aries are moving in with a water sign. Pretty much this water sign already has an already made family. So, okay, and then the, the King of Pentacles here, the King of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. Some of you are dealing with two different um, earth signs, Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. So two earth signs. One earth sign um, is, gonna, is still holding back, and the other earth sign will call you, whether this be a man or a woman. But some of you are juggling two earth signs. Page of Wands. The Page of Wands has their back turned. With the Page of Wands is you, a fire sign. Or you could possibly be dealing with another fire sign. But this is what it shows. The back is turned. One is reaching out and the other person is trying to move forward. And um, typically the, the Page of Wands also symbolizes a lover. So this is saying that the romantic feelings have now gone towards a water sign. So this, this earth sign may have missed their chance. You waited and you waited and you waited. Also, Mercury Retrograde is on the 19th. It starts the 19th of December this month. So exes will be coming back from the past, but don't expect for them to stick around if you do decide to uh, give them a, a second chance, third chance, tenth chance. And uh, keep in mind, if this is the same person that comes around every Mercury Retrograde, yeah, please, please this time, don't mess up your life. Everything's looking good for you, Aries. Just It's just this romantic thing that's coming up here. Because whoever this water sign is for um for you Aries, it's looking good for you. This would be a good match because this shows this is you can't get better than the Ten of Cups. This is happiness in all areas. This is like a really secure, happy family, family outings, uh, financially secure. This is just a, a really good fit. So if if you do have the opportunity to get with this person that has their stuff together and you have your stuff together, I mean that's a really good fit. Because nowadays. <laughs> It's always somebody who has nothing and the other person has to support everything. I'm not talking about a personal experience. It's just what I've seen. I do a lot of readings. Yeah. Um, so it's pretty much looking good. Also, finances are looking good. So if you're waiting to hear about a check or some money coming in, you will be getting that phone call and you're not expecting the phone call is what it's saying. You'll be shocked. Or if, um, if, uh, if you just recently changed your phone number or something like that and you were supposed to be hearing about some money or something like that, Go back and check some stuff. You know, maybe call the people back because they may have lost your number because your back is turned to this. So there, there's something coming in, but somehow it's not able to really reach you face to face. So that that could be the obstacle that you're dealing with why they can't contact you. Either your mailing address is not correct 
or a phone number or they just can't get in touch with you. Um, maybe you haven't checked your mailbox in a while. Check your mailbox. Check everything. There's some money coming your way. All right, Aries. I hope this was helpful. Ta-ta for now.